Hey, welcome to Intima. This is grade 8, lesson 1. And we're talking about simplifying expressions. In order to simplify expressions, it's important to remember the three multiplication properties. The first one is commutative. A times B equals B times A. The next one is associative. A times B times C is the same as a times b and times c and the last one is distributive property a times b plus c is equal to a b plus a c when we try examples look out for those properties in our examples 8 n times 3 I can use the associative property with this uh, product and I can say that 8 times 3 and times n will give me the right answer. 8 times 3 is 24 n. So I simply multiplied the coefficients and added the variable to the final product. Sometimes I need to use distribution in order to simplify the expression. 4 times 3n plus 1. I need to distribute 4 over each term inside the bracket in order for me to get rid of this bracket. So 4 times 3n, 4 times 1. 4 times 3 is 12 and n stays with the term and then plus 4 times 1 is 4 and this is the simplified expression. I have used the distributive property. When there is a positive sign in front of the bracket, so there's nothing here or positive 1 but we just never write it, then the bracket expression remains unchanged when we open the brackets. And if I have a negative 1 in front of the bracket, then every single sign inside the bracket changes to the opposite. And it becomes negative 2x minus 1. This is it for this lesson. Go practice simplifying expressions, collecting like terms, and see how it goes. And we will continue in grade 8, lesson 2. See ya!